Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Tony Hawk's Underground. This is part two and before I do anything I'd like to um, rectify something that I messed up last video uh, when I did my shoutouts and I, I gave a shout out to one Russo Garrett. Uh, I pronounced his name wrong. It's actually pronounced Gosu Garrett. Um, and there's, there's a link to his page and everybody else I shouted out in the first video. So, before we do the final chapter mission, like I promised, we are going to go back and do the fifth mission of the first chapter, which is a tutorial mission hey, learning about JT. skitching. Oh, not out today. Um, actually quite a strange hey, mission. Cool. We have to skitch a Rottweiler to give him a walk. Um, this will, in fact, be used only on cars for the rest of the game. I don't understand how exactly hold on to the end of a bit of a Rottweiler. Or I guess it could be a leech. But yeah, sketching will give you a ton of speed and um, is used to make big jumps and stuff. Uh, in fact, we will use one in a mission coming up here probably in a couple videos. And now to finish off the chapter. Wow, Muska in Jersey? Unreal! I wonder if anyone could So that's what we have to do. We have to impress Chad Moscow by scoring 10,000 points in front of him. It's really not that hard and it can probably be done. In fact, I can guarantee it can be done within the first area in which you skate in front of him. And we already did it. Hey, what's up, man? That was a sick line you had back there. Whoa, Chad Muska? I'm a huge fan. Dang, man, that's some ghetto ride you got rolling, though. Yeah, but I'm pretty broke. I gotta make it last. And so you, here, Chad Back will tell Vegas, us about his I no money, no woes stay, nothing, as a child so and shop sponsor me up. tell so us to go to our shop, local skate shop and get sponsored and as if it were that up. easy. And then he gives hey, us a Christmas present, Merry a Christmas. new skateboard, instead Thanks. of our old crappy Tony Fox Underground beat-up one. And so, right this now. guy just but tells you, you that you need to impress shop, the skaters already sponsored by Stacy Peralta. And so, we're going to go back down here and do a half tutorial mission. Let's see um, teaching you how to get to places, Nicely and then done. transfers. Um, transfers are a big part of this game. Oh, just missed it. <laughs> and I missed it again. And there we go. Nice. Now spine back down, and I'll tell Mr. Peralta you've got skills. And this so teaches you how to spine transfer, which really isn't that hard, and will be used a lot in the game. Here's another type of common Joey, right? mission. Hey, I'm looking um, to get sponsored. By right on. Someone will give well, you, you certain got. tricks to do, and you got to do them. So go up one side of. The At least I think it's this mission. Yeah. Cool. Oh, that wasn't good. Yeah, here, here, here's the part I was talking about. So, um, every trick you do counts and you gotta land it. Um, even though, like it said, nose grab was on there three times, you only have to actually do it once for uh, all, three to, all three to count. And here's another score mission. So you wanna be sponsored, huh? got to be able to put up big numbers under yeah sure no problem okay then let's see what you can do using our setup 15,000 points it's <laughs> more than we had to do to impress Chad Muska so that's uh I guess that's how the game values people some random street skater sponsored by a guy named Stacy Peralta needs to be more impressed than a professional skater who's been skating for years and years and years and I am leaving the skate area, which isn't good, so I only need like a thousand more points. And we're already at the end of this chapter, too. Hey, Sean, what are you doing out here? The dealers took off with some gear from the shop. I'm trying to figure out how to get it back. Where'd they take it? Their place on And so this yeah, mission left it on the front porch. is um, kind of, I guess, like a, like a sneaky mission where you gotta go... Looks like I'm gonna have to sneak over to run, get you know, back. above things and cl climb on They're things. Basically, the use the new game mechanics to get back Most skateboard equipment pride, taken so from the skate shop by those nasty, nasty crack dealers. And dangerous. 
And so you voluntarily choose to go do it and mess with all the crazy crackheads when, you know, they said they'd do it. I don't know what the main character's thinking, but I guess we gotta do it now. So it's it's a really easy mission. Um then that's basically that's basically all you have to do is you have to jump up there, crawl up, and then just run over here and grab uh grab this board. Eric, hey, what are you doing here? Well look, I got the stuff back. And this awesome, is a pretty man. awesome cutscene. Because you know, you Eric is legitimately crazy. What about you? Me? Because oh, they messed up his board and stole the equipment, he decides to set their SUV on fire. Which I'm pretty sure is a felony in most cases. Uh, Maybe Mr. I'm looking for the owner, Mr. Peralta. Wait, are you? And this is where we meet Stacey the Peralta? famed Stacy Peralta. You the guy my skaters have been talking about? Well, I hope so. I'd like to be sponsored. He reminds by me shop. of uh, yeah, so an old residential else. counselor. I'll tell you what. Who, uh, Make me a sponsor me video. Who's always sort of a laid back, hippie sort of guy, okay? but enjoy the fun of things. Don't anything from the same old spots in New Jersey, dude, because I've seen it all. Done. So no he basically tells us that trips. if we want to get sponsored, to make a sponsor video dude, and make it better Steve than Peralta. everybody else's. Don't they show them the same spots in Jersey, so we gotta go find room. a new place to skate. What are you talking about? When I got back to my house last night, they were parked outside waiting for me. I, I, I gotta get the hell out of here. The crack my dealers are trying to kill Eric York. for you setting that shit on fire. To the train station across the river. And now we have to run. This is this is the next chapter, but um, like the previous chapter, we're gonna go back and do the last mission. This one's this one's pretty easy too. You're local, right? Um, Dude, it's 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 hitting a sister. line, which is another pretty common um, <laughs> mission. Oh, yeah. right. So, I don't think we actually even have to combo this one, but uh, it's in in theory you're supposed to hit all of those without what? without stopping the combo. Hit that line. Well, whatever, and here's another one, which involves a manual, which is a move I haven't shown you guys yet. Um, yeah, they don't need to be comboed. Um, a manual is another move that is designed to ooh, designed to uh, elongate combos and keep combos going over flat land. They're actually worth quite a bit of trick uh, points and they can be exploited like the lip tricks and grinds. And it's also a stat area. So I just got 26,000 points for 7 seconds worth of tricks. It kind of shows you how easy this game is to play. Um, I think we can get one last mission here. here. Eric, you okay? I think we lost him. Yeah, there's there's a tombstone you manufacturer we'll in your New Jersey suburb. So the plan is rip. to and get a bunch of scrap up, metal and make a ramp the so that can jump the bridge over the police so they can leave New Jersey so the crack dealers don't kill Eric. It is essentially the craziest plan I've ever heard. But of course, this is a video game, so everything has to be unrealistic. I remember playing this probably one of the first times. I can never figure out where the six piece of trash is because it's not over here. It's, it's all the way over here on this house. It took me probably three or four tries just to figure that out. Need to get to the other side of the bridge, huh? No problem. Those pigs can't stop us. Grab the back of my ride and I'll get you up to speed. Then you try to clear the bridge. So, this is where sketching comes back in. Um, and actually, we got to it this video. I thought it would take a take a bit to get to it. Um, should be able to finish this. So, all we have to do is let go and jump over the bridge. And I completed it even though I landed in the river. Um, that will do it for this part. I will catch you guys next time.